hauntingly beautiful, hauntingly familiar, places, faces of death, faces of myth, faces of war, faces in the crowd. I am the morning, I am the messenger, I am the one. I tell of hearts and souls and dances, with the stars at night, the stars of fire, desire to inspire, sleep, and dreams of being happy, of being born to fly. Hang up where I can see them. Hey, it's me. I'm only trying to help. Keep them hands up. What exactly do you mean by, it's me? <coughs> What's wrong with the air in here? Ah, uh, it's just dry office air. <coughs> Who are you? Or should I say, what? It's me, Tara. Bonnie, look at me. Please. in that carnival suit. Your sister. But that, that isn't possible. Please, Bonnie, believe me. You will all suffocate if you stay in here much longer. You need protective gear. Keep your hands in the air. <coughs> so what is wrong with the air in here? <coughs> We're safe in here, for now. Thank you for saving me. You are my hero. What made you choose, me? You cough. So I thought you must be human. Good thinking, girl. My name is Hermine. <clears throat> well, Hermine, let's see if we can find something in here to protect us from the poison in the air. Poison? Is that what it is? Yes, it's a slow-working toxin. How come you know so much about it? I am the one that broke the humanoid's code and inserted the nemesis virus. Because I was angry about the robots taking away my job. I'm sorry. I'm not the hero you thought I was. What the heck is going on here? They all seem to be sleeping. Not sleeping, sir. My sensors are picking up increasing concentrations of a chlorine-like substance in the air. They're being poisoned. But... how? The ventilation shafts, sir. My guess is the air has shut off the airflow and is pumping the toxic gas into the building. I can only assume something must have gone wrong in its programming. But how? Is that even possible? A virus? Like in the days of old? Anyway, it is very fortunate that you followed my advice on wearing full protective gear, sir. Yes, yes. Now what do we do? I would suggest that I attempt to shut off the AA, sir. Oh? And why can't I be the hero? Because you are no match for the artificial intelligence, sir. No offense. And what about you? They will have you infected with whatever it is in no time. Impossible, sir. You see, I am an obsolete model and therefore invulnerable to whatever has contaminated the AI. A blue monastic sunshine shrouds the earth. Cinnamon trees magnified in the velvety waters. Where friendship smirk and sepia ripples. A choral sung for the epiphany of the universe. I shall crown myself with salt and blossom on the finger of the stars. Nothing but my infinite eye, nothing but my boundless existence, will echo its infinity and reign into eternity.
music, tempting secrets. By Kevin McLeod, Incompetit.com Licensed under Creative Commons 3.0